CG's, uh, Brianna Pettis is learning the new system right now, so... Nice. Gary, you came out yeah. of Cincinnati just like that. A lot of babies at this game. Absolutely loved it. Riverside did get the win in this one. They did. They did. 63-12, to 12, your final in that one. Again, those CG's, uh, Brianna Pettis is learning the new system right now, so we're, we're those... She gets a pass this quarter. week. She, Next she's week, doing, though. She's doing double duty tonight. That's she's right. learning the CG system, and she's also going to be coming up with social media. I right also now. heard she's yeah. working on web, so triple she duty. Follow yeah, JC so on Instagram. Yeah. yeah. There you go. But the yeah, thing, a lot of babies at that game. Fun fact, I wanted to be a pediatrician growing up. That's why I got those highlights of those babies. No baby is safe if JC is <laughs> at the stadium. <laughs> Just so you know. Clearly, I'm gonna, not. Clearly, I'm not. They, they they I'm never safe yeah, at the game. Safe over the place. If you take your baby, most likely JC is going to get put he, in. That baby will be JC's on camera. Shout out to one of my best friends from Riverside, of course. Bernie Ortiz, and you cannot forget Dragging, the legend, Sal Sainz. JC, sick. JC has, has no furniture in his apartment, by the way. None, none so I sleep on the floor. There you go. Uh, we got to check in with our fourth member of the crew, the one and only Will Heron. He's back again for another season. He's done it all on this show. He's even gone so far as shaving his mustache on That's this right. show. So right. you, know he's, you know he's really into this show. I got the bus home at night every night. What is up, my brothers from other mothers? Oh, it feels so nice to be back. A brand new blitz season. So let's stop talking and start highlighting. Off the bat, we got two 618s going out at the ever powerful El Dorado Aztecs taking on the powerhouse East Lake Falcons. And let's jump into that first quarter of action. East Lake would take the opening kickoff to El Dorado's 27 yard line. Then two plays later, Elijah Uribe would fake the handoff. Hair finding the open. Anthony the Moreno strike first. The Falcons would get it done, son, on the defensive end of the ball as well. Caleb Emery shrugs his shoulders. Blockers introduces himself to El Dorado. Hello there. Still in the first quarter, East Lake taking it to the Aztecs. New quarterback in, Sebastian Rendon. This time it's Isaiah Travis who finds himself open. Rendon finds him for the touchdown, but the refs found a block in the back, and this one would not count. Boo Boo knows. Falcons, student section not having it. A couple plays later, and Rendon wants a doo doo over over. He drops the ball in the wide receiver's hands for the end of the round, and then gives it right back. He sees the other quarterback, Elijah Uribe, to double the Falcons' score. And you know what? We don't exactly. There, there's our scoring thing get filled in, but I'm not going to throw Brianna Pettis under the bus like you guys did. <laughs> be a system issue. <laughs> I, might that, just be a system issue. That's not be. working. I saw her feeling I did too. Out. She works hard. She's good stuff. She does. Let's go over here to Midland game. Make it happen, Kevin. Christian Midland must have met the American Star Blazers at the sack for the early game, and that's Mr. Dumas. His son Aaron pretty much built the sack, guys. First quarter, second drive, the bus things exactly. River Rodriguez at the helm on the Trail Blazers 18 yard line, takes snap, then bolts to the left for the first toddy of the game. Trail Blazers, they know how to score two. Still in the first senior, Caleb Miller from the gun and drops back, rolls to his right, fights off a would be tackler, finds an America's receiver to get into scoring position. Trailblazers knocking. Again, Miller from the gun, except he's solo this time. Rolls to his favorite right side and decides to take things in his own hands. Goes on the board. Over a Mustang defender. The dude can fly. Gets Americas on the board. Wow. Miller Christian, though. Top. They came to play. Second quarter. Dylan Crotter gets the hand up up the middle, and the route begins. The Mustangs, they're going to take it. 42 to 17. Yowzers. Now let's go here. The Monahan Lolo showed up at Clinton. Throw down with the line, and I know this. Someone's gonna get bit tonight. Things not starting well for the Lobos as the returners gets taken out by his own dude. Wow! <laughs> Telling you, Monahan's having trouble holding on to the ball as their quarterback fakes the handoff, steps up into the pocket to run, and would lose the handle. Giving it right back to the Leones. Clint's drive would stall, and the Lobos would get the ball to try again, still in the first quarter after a missed clear field goal by and starting from their 20 wouldn't matter Leonard Davis got him a step on the cover makes the grab and cruises into the end zone the Lobos crush the Lions 49 to 17 fellas I'm gonna sneak over to the break room here in a minute score me some speedies pizza oh, yeah. oh, we gotta it. shout out the speedies it took three guys to uh, to bring him in there I was, was not lying. They were heavy. We just wanted to get in on it first. Shout out to the uh, person holding the gate open for me at Burgess who saw the nine pizzas in my backseat. <laughs> and, uh, and, and I told and I told and I told him that I actually I, like I have two jobs. I actually deliver pizzas on the side to make a couple extra bucks. And he believed it. Man. My man, I wish. 
Good job. Over at Speedy's, best I've ever had. Thank you to Speedy's. Totes per Every Friday night, they deliver. And on that note, guys, let's go ahead and take our first commercial break. Again, this show is sponsored by Southwest University. When we come back, we'll head on over to Austin High School's The Panthers. We're hosting the Scorpions tonight. We'll also head to La Bowie. Nate was at this game as Fort Stockton. Oh, yeah. visit to El Paso tonight. The Bears.